You had 12 days. Not so many, but enough. One more day has passed. The town shifts. Something stirs in the theater. Something stirs within you. That was down to the wire. So I was probably right to not go rushing off to that track. Yep. Oh, cons in the polyhedron is still a thought we're having, though. Yeah, the next day hasn't started yet. I always gotta remember that. Like, there's a... A particular way time works, where you kind of have a buffer time where you can still do stuff, I think? What's this? After dark, step people meet at Saba's place. Not just them, either. Yep. Let's, I guess we'll visit the theater before we, before we run out of time. Yeah. So here's when the night properly begins. Wait, that's one of the enemies, isn't it? I don't have any ammo for this gun. It's just a... it's for show at the moment. Let go. There we go. I like how I attacked him and they're like, let go. That was a strange, audible reaction to the bad boy being uh, coming after me. Get going with this. Always want some blood. I think I'm focusing on the blood for now. I'm gonna have inventory spaces otherwise, uh, inventory problems otherwise. But that blood, very useful, directly so. How are we doing on bottles? We're good? Good. I went and broke my knife, huh? It. Evidently ineffective now. It did not last long. Overall, doggo! The weird sight. Look alive, brothers and sisters. This one is in cahoots with Notkin's crew. So tell me, old man, which side are you really on? I'm on my own. What do you even want, big man? Have you come to drag us home? Tough luck. We're going home when we want, and not a minute earlier. As I see it, there's a fight brewing here. What's the problem, kids? That's our great conflict, old man. The soul and I have see our tower as the root of all evils. And we can't live without it. The tower makes people into super people. The soul and I have would rather become mindless pets. So if they want to be beasts, why are you the ones wearing the dog masks? For a good reason. These masks remind us we're still beasts, and the true humans inside us have yet to come out. They can't see well, are almost deaf, and speak only in gibberish. Lots of room left for growth. And what's in it? And what's with the four on one? First off, it's five on one and a half. He does have half a soul more than ordinary folk. Second, we're not here to kick his ass. We're the one, they're the ones keen on bashing us with clubs and worse. Us, we're a peaceful bunch. We find on, we fight only in self-defense. Why'd you drive him up there like a cat in a tree? We're teaching him discipline. He should get used to heights. You don't mind if I go upstairs and talk to him too, don't you? Go ahead. Who's stopping you? See for yourself. The higher you go, the better it gets. I find the down below no less fascinating. Pfft, yeah, right. Have fun with all the stiffs and maggots around you. That's not all there is. They're saying that they drove somebody up there. 
The dialogue was about stuff that I didn't know about yet. Oh, yeah, there they are. Hiding in the dark, all spooky-like. Oh, this is a neat one. There he is. Smoky. Are you supposed to be animating? Oh, there you go. I wasn't sure. They looked frozen. So what they tell you? You kids play curious games these days. Our times were simpler. It used to be peaceful. Each gang only mingled with their own. But recently it escalated into outright war. To be honest, we struck first. But that's because they got under our skin. You be on your way, big man. Adults have no business in our wars. Maybe I can parlay peace between your two factions. That's alright. All will be quiet when we gather at the station this evening. That's our no man's land. A good place. You gather at the cargo station? At the passenger one. We used to gather at the cargo. It was cooler. But now it's all boarded off. You'll only get... You'll only end up with broken legs. And we've got girls and little kids there, too. So we gather at the platform. I'll drop by, if that's fine with by you. Stop prying. Grown-ups not welcome where we gather. You ruin everything. I'll just peek with one eye. Just been driven up here. It keeps... Oh, what's up here? Interesting. Who's even putting stuff up here? You can see rebar sticking out of the concrete. We reach the final doorway. And then you jump! No. I would not recommend doing that. It's not a great idea. You heard about this new thing? It's called gravity. It's the sequel to flying. The budget got cut. I should check to see if I can get a rumble. Look at that fence! It's just floating. That's a sight. No rumble. I thought for a second, but I think those are drums. Like in the soundtrack. Alright, you guys enjoy your games, you lunatics. What? I think this guy's bugged. I think the I think the guards killed him, and he's lootable. But he's in a pose, like he's standing there. Red. It costs four. Uh, I'm not happy about that price. Also, I can't hold it, but I'll figure that out. Can I for well, if I'm giving two, yeah, I'll take a chestnut, I guess. Oh, the red's not a 2x2, two two, it's a 1 slot. So I do have room for it. I lose track of that stuff. And I got a chisel for my other upgrade, my other repair project. So that's good, but the inventory is quickly filling right back up again. I'm not psyched about selling off my, re my, my repair resources, but... I also don't want to die. Oh, I can't afford that. I, I, I also really want my, uh, my upgrades available. Let's see, I'm pool. We're working our way there. That's how I'll last to the theater.
My favorite items to find are the ones that stack with the stuff I already have. <laughs> it's really the primary motivation. So I need to find cloth. Hello. Ah, uh, hello, fellow traveler. I suspect this is not the last time we chat. I recognize you. So you're a merchant? I dabble in buying and selling, but I have no use for coins. Though I often find I have two to rub together. I collect things. Things that are old, broken, discarded. Dead items. Memories. Husks. And husks of memories. Traces, as I call them. Oh, dead items. They actually have a use. What use do you have for that junk? I just like it when things are tidy. If I don't, people leave things behind. Evidence of their passage. I mean, a mess. Won't do. Better to take those things into my bag. An unpleasant occupation. It's good work. When a rag and bone man does the rounds, no door stays shut. Who else ke who keeps useless junk? Everyone's happy to see me. Everyone trusts me. It makes for a peaceful harvest. Aren't you afraid of being out at night? I only work nights. It's a ripe time. Does it frighten me? No. Nor should it frighten you. The town changes each night. Turns to different places to explore. What was open during the day closes, and what was closed opens. Happy to make your acquaintance. You'll get a lot of traces from me, I'm sure. This is the character we verified doesn't exist. We verif like we verified that this guy isn't real, basically. He's, uh, 17, well... Is stuff worth a lot with you, at least? I can get ammo out of, the, out of you. Or bracelets. Worn to cut off the flow of warmth between the heart and the ring finger. Too small for me. Cut off the flow of warmth between the heart and the ring finger. Why? What? Huh. So broken ampoules and stuff like that actually do have a use. But, uh, they're gonna, they're gonna take some stocking up. Oh my, ah, uh, lock picks don't stack. Because they have individual durabilities. He even takes blood. But I'll need to give him a lot if I want this. It's Clara's hooks, kind of. <clears throat> I do have a scrap name, but everything here is very expensive. I'd have to sell a bunch of my stuff to get even some of it. Three things for one shotgun shot. Damn. Worth, worth knowing about, though. It means it's probably worth stacking these things up in my stash, and then when I have enough of it, I can try to find him and see if I can sell it all off. Is that self- that was a self-made waypoint? <clears throat> Wrong door. Okay, that's not good for my health. Uh, what can I do food-wise? White whip. Oh no, I have more herbs than fit in my, my pouch. A rare bitter herb growing wherever there is fear and anguish. Herbs are made to, used to make tinctures. White whip is poisonous. It can kill. Base is going to become a problem. Also, so is my food situation rather quickly. Yeah, that's not great, use, great news for me. And it didn't even eat the meter down. All right. I can't you eat herbs. <laughs> Some of them are even poisonous. I can trade a revolver. Value 17. 
I know, I'll trade the revolver for the bullets. What a great idea. I make- I have the best plans. I can't fit that in my inventory. More bottles. Yeah, I'm not gonna casually run around with like a hundred of them like I did before. Ah. Uh, I really should have just rearranged it immediately anyway. I can make it fit. That's Dr. Bad, man. Let's get inside. Before bad happens. <clears throat> Hello. What have we here? I can work miracles. I just lay hands on a person and they... You know, if they had cancer, or a tumor, or something in the blood. I'm not very good with terms, but God loves me. Three years ago, a cure for typhoid was found. Four years ago, for the Blue Death. A year ago, for a strain of smallpox. Science is all-powerful. Local medicine can do a lot. Although, while studying, I started to see it as backwards, but... It did work at times. Well, satisfied with your boasting? Trying to impress each other like little kids? Unbelievable. Enough with this ridiculous meeting, you bunch of quacks. No type of medicine will help you here. What a trip. So Clara, <laughs> it's so hard to like her. Even she's just like, yeah, like whatever, man. I'll just, it'll just like work out. Cause like I have superpowers. Yeah. That's her, that's her narration. The dead item shop is open. I do want to go there before it goes too late, but ah. Uh, I'm pressing myself too thinly. And we constantly have exhaustion killing us now. But if I sleep with the morphine and everything to squash it out, that's like four hours lost. Knowing my luck, that'll be the end of the night. I'm still trying to make it work before it runs out. I don't think there's anything here. Go, go, go. I should, f I should visit a clothing store because I imagine it's where you can buy a bolt of cloth. I could be wrong, but I don't think I've seen one before. So I imagine you buy them there. Which is not great news for me because I don't have money. At the moment, really. Grocery, clothes. That'll be coming up soon. Did I just go on the floor? Did I- I was able to hold that? Yeah, I, had, I already have a razor. Uh, stacking items are so welcome. One of the strange, not-so-logical elements of video games at times. Things you can carry... Massive qu- you can, you, can, you can carry 500 of one item, but... Find two different items? Man. Massive in increase in inventory space used. Let me in. It's tempting to put this on the SSD, but... I always end up getting like two things on my SSD, and then I'm like stuck with those things, because I don't really want to uninst uninstall those things, but then I also... Yeah. It never goes how- it never goes according to plan. You don't even sell coffee. It's like the one thing I want. You will buy most things. That's the path I want to go. Fermented product. And hazelnuts. Tempting. But I do want... I can sell these excess water bottles because I have so many of them, I suppose. 
I'm just gonna want to have spare stuff so I can buy my food. Mm. Oh, I have so many springs. I could just go all in. I'm honestly just kind of resigned to how much I'm going to regret all the decisions I make. Uh oh. You say ineffective, but is it though? <laughs> Not that ineffective at least. Empty bottle required. All right, well, just gonna have to chug. There we go. There we go. Always collect. Oh, that exhaustion's becoming a problem. Pick lock, they'll know you. No, knock. The tenants trust you for now. Is this not the clothing store? I just want to buy clothing. Oh, you can trade for coffee, <sighs> but for razors. And it costs seven, so I can't actually afford it. Shit. Coffee wants the same items though, because they're the same person repeating over and over again. They'll know. Yeah, the game says that they'll know. I think there may just not be a stealth system in this game when it comes to thieving. It just straight up is saying that they will know. I appreciate that the lock picking is a different button. So you don't accidentally press the lock pick button as like a surprise. Oh. Can't afford it. It's also not quite what I'm looking for. Alright, so this is not the store. It's my first time inside of a tenant's house. Not quite ready to start aggressively robbing people. I'm here for your cloth. Give it, give it, give it, give it, give it. No. You only sell safety pins. Buttons were, wow. Huh. Buttons are worth less to him than the person that sells food. That's, that feels a little odd. What is value? Guns are valuable to you. Yeah, no big priority items. Well, that busts up my entire plan. Shit. Someone is waiting for me. Come on. Let's just try to max out our progress today. Before I have to pass out on like somebody's couch. I probably won't make it home. Uh, but I should for the morphine. Yeah, I want to make it home for the morphine because the morphine... I think it both makes you rest better and it gives you health back. Which I need because I've been up for so long that my health is half gone. Now, lend me your eyes and ears. 
We trust you, so we'll let you in on the game. Whoa, sounds important. Very much so. We've never ever allowed an adult into the great game. It's forbidden. You'll be the first. Or rather the second. Believe me, we wouldn't invite you if not for that first one. The first one? The one. The one everyone's after. The person who's... Well... The old man. I mean, your father. I mean, you know. Have you, like... Seen them? We've seen whatever they left in our game. That's enough. What game? So let me explain. We have these caches. Lots of them all over town. That's what we leave... Me that's where we leave messages and gifts for one another. It's a test of intuition. If you find one, you get to the next level. It also tests greed. Whoever takes items without giving anything in return gets kicked out. But that's not important. Not what you should be thinking about. I feel like I should be thinking about it because I just got, I think I already got kicked out. I already took stuff from that one cash, I think. What should I be thinking about then? The murderer left some items tonight. From the old man. Bloody. Something. Bloody something in a scary note. Saying they know we'll try to catch them. That we're reading it. That they see all. It shook me to my boots. Where'd you find those items? There are two caches nearby. The dam and the bowsprit. Go, and you'll see for yourself. Only, if you take from a cache, leave something too. Respect the rules or it'll all go south. The dam and the bowsprit. Huh. I do respect rules. I will follow them. The player is already gathered here in the stone yard next to the, next to the caches. I mean, they've already been to the middle town and the earth. Maybe they found something there too. I believe three parties are already there. They might know more, but I don't know where they are. I've been standing here, waiting for you to pass by like an idiot. Three groups of kids scattered across the stone yard, huh? Got it. Things have gotten strange. The children's stash is here somewhere. The more players of the game spend their time nearby, I should keep my eyes peeled. Isn't that... Ah. Uh. Those are very spread out. Interesting. Oh, is it getting lighter outside? I feel like it is. You still can't get to the polyhedron. It's physically blocked these days. Okay. Hey, to break it to you, big fella, but we don't just let anyone in. I'm here to speak to Khan. Khan? What do you want with him? Important business. We'd know if he wanted to see you. Know why you're all grown up? Because you forgot how to lie. There's an art to it. I'm not getting in, am I? Those are the rules. The tower is all ours. No adults allowed. So the tower is chock full of kids? We got some space left. There's only 700 of us. Holy shit. Are you sure it won't fall? You're asking too many questions. To hell with these games. Tell Khan I said hi. Making sounds. Is it moving? No, I think it's motionless. That, th that thing is a trip. Khan barely leaves the new building across the river. I can't reach him. The things are wrapping up in ways where we are verifying we can't find shit for people. But maybe I could talk to the canes? Why don't they sell a shirt of this? They have a handful of shirts, but one of them is like a bunch of bulls, for example. And one of them's a clock. I'm like, no, sell a, sell the freaking polyhedron. Or even a map of the town.
No, oh, can I not get in? Nope. Again. If I find the right door. I haven't met the, met the canes yet. I should probably get something moving here. Hey, you got a haircut. Yorgi. I, I can't talk to him. But I can save.